there, Ulti Zeta here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Mega Man and Base 2 Challenger in the Future as part of the Mega Man World Anthology, even though it's not part of Mega Man World, I don't know. In the last episode we were doing stuff, but in this episode I want to go to the shop, actually, before I do anything else. Because we can get an extra life here for 200 bolts for some reason. I can't use that because it's a forte thing. Regain double the life energy. A party ball. Call Eddie. Protects you from one spikes. Reduces damage taken. So... So there's the energy balancer here. There's... Weapons use half as much energy. Or reduce damage taken. I haven't really been using the weapons that much at all. So I'm gonna go for damage, I think. Is this it? Yes. I love that the smug cartoon look on Dr. Light's face here. <laughs> Alright. All set, my son? Yes. Alright. So with that having been bought now, let's fight this guy. Komuso man! He doesn't get translated. I don't know what a Komuso is, but I'm assuming it's something Japanese. Alright, Burner Man's theme. I really hope that's not a signal, a signal of anything. You know what's interesting? I realized it when... I realized it when, like, I was testing the game, but I haven't brought it up in right now yet or anything. Actually, no, this isn't Burner Man, this is Pirate Man, I think. What am I supposed to hit here? Very top of him, I guess. Alright. Um, this game does a thing that I only really remember seeing in... Uh, fan ROM hacks. And that's this little bit right here. The zero life meter. It... The game tracking your lives in that particular way is just an intriguing element. Also, I feel like the other thing I should remember... Also, Frog! Hello, Frog. Uh, the other thing I should remember is... Th oh, okay! <laughs> I have... How are you supposed to know? <laughs> Which one is about the fire? <laughs> well, I'm glad I got the takes half damage function. I had a feeling these platforms were gonna start dropping. Do 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 do. This game really likes putting death spikes on the ceiling for you to slide under. Dance with me, frog. Alright. Blah, 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 blah. D-pad, fucking D-pad! I'm using the D-pad to make it more consistent because, like, using the analog stick for that just feels awkward, but the D-pad just keeps swapping on me! 
I've never had a problem with a D-pad like this before, but now it's just suddenly f***ing me up. I was gonna get an extra life in anything, and instead I got a game over and I have to redo everything. So I'll be right back. I can't even blame the game. That's entirely the controller. Because legitimately all- I should- I should say, legitimately all I'm doing is just holding down on the D-pad. I'm not holding left or right, I'm just holding down. Oh, the frogs don't hurt you, they... hit you with the bubble. I tried to jump and it didn't let me jump. God damn it! Jeez, almost as if it's just as simple as a couple of slides. I'm just gonna stop using the D-pad. Trying to be safer, and instead it's just killing me. I mean, other than, like, the mini-boss, and my own personal problems, the stage is, so far is kind of fine. I'm really to write home about, positive or negative. I was like, where the hell do I go? But then I saw the ladder. I like how the ladybug, ladybug got stuck. You know, the charge shot is exceptionally strong in this game that I'm noticing. Like, compared to like, fighting regular enemies, it's just like... Okay, I can just grab that from there. Oh, this fucker. trust those jumps. Okay. I think I just need to go. <laughs> I was like, I, I, I couldn't fight that guy. Alright. Let's go. Giant. I'm not doing any damage. Hit the head. I think he's only vulnerable during this fire phase, which is obnoxious. But I'm getting a bit better at everything else.
Yeah, it's not like hit the right one or anything. Okay. So they always go to the center. center. Now stay behind him. He goes that way. He goes to the center. He goes to the center. Jump in here. Goes to the center. Goes to the center. Goes to the center. And that should be it. Okay, I didn't even need the weakness. Obnoxious boss fight, but whatever. Alright. And that's those four Roller Masters down. You got the Doppel Crash. Okay, it's just a dash attack. Sure. And now we have another new stage. Proto Man, who is my lookalike? He is your shadow. He gains power from each robot you beat. What? How can I stop him? Don't worry about his power. Be true to yourself and you'll win. Thanks, Proto Man. Now let's fight the Clockman. Look at him dance. Oh, it's the worst song from Mega Man Bass. Now made even more war sound, worse sounding. This is Astro Man's theme. Have much to say. I'm not like gonna say like the novelty of the game is worn off, but like I think it's just kind of sinking in that what what like I'm playing a Mega Man game. Okay, so those guys only take damage when they're like facing Mega Man in, like, the context of, like, how he would see them. So the less we see them, the more invulnerable they are. Does that make sense? I don't know. I don't know. The, what I'm, like, gathering from this game is that there's interesting bits of the game. Like, it's not fundamentally terrible. It's just messed up. Which I think makes it more interesting, because it's not like the DOS games, which are just flat out bad, and don't expect those to ever show up. <laughs> Be. Well, that's really annoying. I really would have liked that extra life. Unfortunately, it spawned from, like, the worst possible enemy. The first one.
Ugh, I do not like that sprint. Oh, I don't like this either. I don't trust this. This is the kind of thing I would make a restore point on. Okay, you can stand on these this thing safely. got Mets wrong in this game. The amount of damage they take to kill, like, the speed at which they, like, jump out on you... It's just wrong. What the heck is this thing? As far as the mini mosses go, this is definitely much better than the, some of the others. All right, Bell. That bat is like that bat. Finally, is like one of the only things that I've spent, encountered that like actually looks like a Mega Man enemy. Meanwhile, I have these bats now. It's like, they don't look like Mega Man enemies at all. Excuse me! Excuse me? What the f- huh? There's an arrow on the ground that I missed, and it flips the gravity around. Okay. I guess I understand now. I don't agree, but I understand. Why is there a gravity switching mechanic in a clock stage? So strange. Alright, well, they gave me extra life because they felt bad for me. Oh, good. I don't like that. Stop giving me these springs! They're so tight, I don't like it. Alright. The Clockmen are weak to the Barrier Wind. Or the Doppel Crash. Hello!
Well, it's doing a lot of damage. But I'm taking- I'm also taking a lot of damage. Shoot them once, shoot them once. Alright. Awkward fight, don't like using that weakness. Probably would have had a better time if I didn't, honestly. But, I took him down. You got time switch! I can freeze- <laughs> Name another Mega Man game where Mega Man gets hurt in the weapon get cutscene. Okay. Well, we got this guy left, Compass Man. I think I have the time to do this in this episode. So... Uh, let's go back to the shop. Regain double the life energy. I think that's definitely worth it, and then I'll, after that I'll start doing the... Uh, other things. Please let me go through. I just want to talk to Mega Man Shadow. That is not an option. I am Mega Man Shadow's first lieutenant, Compass Man. His new base is just up ahead, but you won't make it that far. This ends here. Compass Man! He splits himself up. Wait, no. No, this is Pirate Man. God, I don't know the Mega Man bass songs, apparently. I know all of them, like, song-wise, but I don't know who's who, apparently. Unless I listen to them all in direct succession, I guess. I'd, I'd probably be able to purse them out that way, but like... Whatever. So was it Burger Man from before? I don't know. Do, do, do. Oh! Good thing I got an extra life there, huh? Can I kill this guy, please? Whoa, that conveyor belt surprised me. I would just like to ignore this guy. Okay. That's all I wanted from that. A screw tank. Honestly, as far as main bosses go, that's probably the best one. 
fair enough concept. Decent execution. Oh, that mini boss was a big version of this enemy. Interesting. Weapon energy doesn't refill like the other... The fact that the... <sighs> the fact that the stage music deletes itself in order to... down the other path. I made it harder on myself. Well, I can't get that because I don't have Rush because you have to buy him in this game. And I have not yet bought him. may just be like the first enemy that doesn't die to one charge shot. Buggy McBug face! I hate him. Kill it. Kill it. Damn it. What? No! Ah! You don't have to aim, you just have to hit him during this part of the dance! How did I take until now to figure that out about Buggy Bugface? So just do that part fast, and it's not that much of a problem. Okay, is that the end of the stage? It is. Alright. I keep feeling like most of the bosses go down better with the Buster anyway, so let's try and fight Compass Man now. What part do I even hit? Good animation there. Maybe he's just immune to the buster. One second. <laughs> okay. So, I'm gonna run out of this, which is unfortunate. But I guess you fight that part of him? I don't know what happens now. I looked at a video and that was what the person did. Okay. 
Yeah, that's just a really tough shot. I hate this trend of roll-up masters in this game that, like, you can't... can't hit without a, being a very specific Wii point. Alright. I took him down. <laughs> Voila. Alright. I'm gonna end the episode... end the episode here and now. So, next time on Let's Play Mega Man and Base 2 Challenger from the Future. Uh, we got Fortress to go. I don't know how long it's gonna be. This might be a short episode. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Either way, I'm ready for this to be over. This was amusing, but it's definitely starting to overstay its welcome. <laughs>